In this episode, I will be deflating some bloated batteries. So recently, my Mavic Pro batteries started to bloat. This is probably due to me leaving the batteries in the charger for extended periods of time. Now I know, I know, you shouldn't leave your batteries in the charger once they are fully charged. But DJI market these as intelligent flight batteries with microchips that prevent overcharging. I guess they are not that intelligent after all. Now, I'm not really bothered by bloated batteries. However, now that the batteries are bloated, they can no longer fit properly in the drone. So, in order to fix this problem, I'm going to poke a hole in the battery and release some of the gas that has built up inside. Without wasting any more time, let's get poking. Warning! Puncturing a lithium-ion polymer battery is stupid and very dangerous. Lithium will ignite to very high temperatures when exposed to moisture. So please do not follow what I'm about to do unless you know what you're doing. So these are my bloated Mavic Pro batteries. I will be puncturing all three, but in this video, you only see me do it once. For this experiment, I will puncture these batteries with only a simple safety pin. Nothing fancy, no special tools, just a safety pin. And just like that, we're done. The next step is to push out all the gas inside the cell. And now that most of the gas is pushed out, I'll cover the hole with electrical tape. Yes, I know I could probably do a better job pasting the tape, but I'm going to replace these batteries anyway, so I don't really care. The next step is to charge the batteries. I will be doing a test to see if there is any drop in performance, so I need all my batteries at full for a fair test. Now that the batteries are full, Let's do the performance test. Safety comes first. Since I'm not sure how reliable these batteries are anymore, I will just be hovering the Mavic Pro in the air at about 1.5 meters and timing how long it takes before the batteries hit 10%. And here are my results. All three batteries show a drop in flight time. It could only manage between 13 to 16 minutes of hovering. Previously, I could get about 20 minutes of flight time and that is with proper flying and not just hovering. So I guess, in conclusion, once your batteries are bloated, just replace them with new ones. Puncturing them will reduce performance. You could probably still use them for a while longer, but in my opinion, it just isn't worth the hassle or risk. 